Hello everybody and welcome to chat from the engineering desk. Today we're going to have another look at um, part I designed in CAD, built a model of, and um, made it work to demonstrate the working principles. It is a auger filler or a screw feeder, whichever way you like to call it, which is used for measuring out material which is held in this hopper and then moved along by the auger down the spout into a container where the amount that has been moved through here is weighed so it's like a filling system for food and soap products and all sorts of stuff you want to take bulk and measure it out into a container in smaller quantities to be uh, supplied to the consumer so here we have the cutaway of our object so what happens inside them the material falls in here and when this screw rotates the material this cavity over here effectively moves in this direction until the material ends up here where it falls out and it goes into the weighing system which has got load cells and a scale and so on and that controls the motor which turns the screw over here and determines how much to turn to fill the container here up to the desired weight. And that's how an auger filler works. And that's how it looks sectioned over here in my CAD program. So if you go back to looking how it looks as a complete thing, that's what it looks like. So if you look up the end you can see the screw over there and similarly looking down the hopper that's what you'd see inside it and on the back of it would be a motor of any kind and a gearbox usually which couples the motor to the screw and gets the thing spinning so that's what they look like. Just a quick little talk on uh, auger fillers and feeders. Something some of us have seen, some others haven't seen. Thought it'd be interesting. Maybe you learned something from it, found it interesting. It was nice to have you here. Join me for more videos. And I hope you have a wonderful day further. Cheers.